1 John 5, verse 18, NKJV. We know that whoever is born of God does not sin, but he who has been born of God keeps himself, and the wicked one does not touch him. This verse is confusing to a lot of people. They think, so if I sin, does that mean I'm not born again anymore? Absolutely not. This verse is referring to your spirit man. What is born of God within you is your spirit. If you are tempted to sin, that comes from either your body, your soul, or most often, a combination of them both. Your born-again spirit cannot sin, and the enemy cannot touch it. This verse. Once you were born again, the Holy Spirit came and sealed your spirit within you. Ephesians 1, verse 13. Vacuum-packed it so that the enemy can't corrupt it or steal anything from within it. Why is that important to know? It's important because God has given you everything you need for life and godliness, 2 Peter 1, 3, and it is all available within your spirit, man. Your spirit is the ultimate big box store where every item is free. It has everything you could ever imagine needing in mass supply, and the Holy Spirit is the security system to make sure the enemy doesn't break in and steal something. If you need joy, it is there. If you need peace, it is there. If you need healing, it is there. The enemy can never steal what God has freely given you through the sacrifice of his son. The enemy can't steal healing from you because it is part of what Christ purchased for you. It is part of your inheritance and nothing he can do can ever take that away from you. He can hinder you from receiving it through fear and doubt based on what you see or feel, but he can never strip it from the inside of you. Recognize today that your healing is within you. It's not something you're waiting on. It's not far away and on its way to you. It is within you, right there. Healed is who you truly are. Think on that above all else.